Hello guys, uh, I'm gonna show you how to render a GIF using uh, Blender 2.8 and Photoshop. I have a simple animation of this lander with some particles going. As you see my window is 1080 by 1080, my camera window. Well, first of all, go into the render properties and film and enable transparent then go into the output properties and make sure you got PNG chosen RGBA and you can either use 8 or 16 bit color and then uh, once you're ready and you have your animation ready just uh, render it from here render animation uh, make sure uh, I forgot to tell you to um, choose your folder uh, by default it will be a temporary folder so you're gonna have to choose a folder that uh, you want okay see in Photoshop alright guys so here we are in Photoshop um, first go into window and enable timeline which I already did down here uh, again, then go into file, scripts, load files into stack. You'll get this dialog box and you can either choose files and it's gonna load them one by one or you can choose, a, choose an entire folder and then browse for your folder where you save the PNGs from Blender and there is mine. It's gonna take a little bit to load them up, a few seconds. Okay, once they're loaded, just click OK. And it's gonna start loading them into the layers panel. Uh, it'll take uh, quite a few minutes. Mine on 1080 by 1080, 98 uh, images took about five to seven minutes or so. So I'm just gonna skip over this. Alright guys, uh, once you have all your images loaded into the layers panel, uh, make sure you're on uh, create frame animation from this menu, just click on it. And the first image is going to load up, then go into this menu right here, and choose make frames from layers. So it's going to load all the images. Uh, now. If you want to loop forever, just choose forever right here and your GIF to loop forever. And then um, go into File, Export. Don't go here, go down here at uh, Save for Web Legacy. And you'll get this uh, dialog takes a second to load up okay I found out that these uh, settings right here are the best because you know sometimes GIFs can get these weird edges with white and by by cubic smoother mine is obviously 1080 by 1080 don't forget to enable transparency right here Oh, I got one uh, 128 bit colors and ether at 88% I will just uh, copy all these settings and then just click save and it'll give you a choice where to save it into I already have mine so you just save it but I'm not going to and just click done uh, it takes only a second to render this uh, GIF and that's it. There you go, guys. Uh, thanks for watching and uh, subscribe. And we'll see you in the next one. Take care, guys. Bye bye.